Well, I finally made a chance to make a video, and this time I decided to be a little late on the trend. I uh, came out to Burger King to try the Impossible Whopper. My daughter brought that home for me one day, and it was okay. I only had a couple bites. I couldn't really do a full taste test on it. So I bought a Whopper and an Impossible Whopper. I'm going to give it a test, and we'll go from there. I'm also meeting my uh, my twin. He'll be here any any minute, and then we'll we'll get started here. Let me get these things out of the bag just to kind of give you an idea. The regular Whopper was four dollars and fifty some cents. The Impossible Whopper was like five dollars and fifty plus cents. Those are U.S. dollars. Let's get these out of the wrapper here and take a look at these things. Well, it never looks like the commercial, does it? Looks like they just threw it on there. That's the regular Whopper. Here's the Impossible Whopper. So, they look the same. One's patty made entirely of plants. This one's made out of beef, we think. So, my favorite is the Whopper, obviously. And here's the Impossible Whopper. Let's give it an inside a look. There's that patty out of beef. Who knows what that is? I, you know, I, I read somewhere online, there's like 21 ingredients in that patty. And here's your regular patty. So, hey, and my twin is here, so he'll be joining us and he'll be trying some of this stuff too with me. I'm going to eat the Impossible Whopper. We'll let my twin eat the Whopper. What do you think? I've got the Whopper, the great American hamburger, home of the Whopper at Burger King. Okay. It tastes really, really good. Did you guys know that the Whopper was introduced in 1957? I checked this out on Wikipedia. And they used to sell it for 37 cents. Now the Whopper goes for $4.50. Here goes the Impossible Whopper. How do you like eating that thing? It's okay. <laughs> well, ain't no Whopper. That's why it's impossible. How's yours? Something about a Whopper. When I was a little kid, my dad would always take me to Burger King, uh, like maybe on a, a Saturday or something if we worked on the yard or uh, do something outdoors. And he'd be like, you want to go get a Whopper? So we'd go get a Whopper, home of the Whopper, BK. Now, obviously, 37 cents back in 1957. Big difference right now in 19, uh, 2019, I should say. Uh, but obviously, income's a little different. Cost of living, everything goes up. This is good. Much better. I mean, from the looks of it, it looks like a pretty decent burger. Right? Let me take a bite out of that one. No. Definitely don't like that one. I mean, it's it's not bad, but if I had to choose between the two of them, my go-to would be the Whopper for sure. I'm not even sure why you would want to order that plant-based thing. I mean, I would go with the beef. Just like you said, where's the beef? The Whopper is much better, much more tastier. If you wanted to try something different, you know, a different choice and have a burger made out of plants, well, what do you expect? It's not going to taste like an actual burger. They use the same buns. Want to take a look at the patty? There's a patty. Kind of looks like a normal patty, doesn't it? They put mayonnaise, tomato, mustard, onion, and pickle. The basic things they put in a Whopper. I don't know. I mean, I guess I'm just not used to it. It's lacking something. It's lacking the beef. Where's the beef? <laughs> I would probably not order this again. Hey, that, that's okay. I mean, it's an impossible Whopper. It's impossible to duplicate the Whopper. <laughs> My go-to is the actual Whopper made of beef. Thanks. Thanks for letting me tag along here with you.
you can have me come anytime you decide you want to have a Whopper, but I'm not going to have the Impossible Whopper. I probably won't order again, just like you said. I'd rather go with the actual Whopper, but thanks for joining me. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Make your decision what you'd rather choose, the Whopper or the Impossible Whopper. If you guys have eaten this, leave some comments below. I'd be curious what you think of it. I know um, it ain't bad. Maybe you like it. I, myself, will go with the regular Whopper. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. You can buy me a Whopper any day. Give me that. <laughs>